Um, Iran um, was another point that, 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 uh, that was raised. Um, again, uh, a, very, a very unfortunate situation. Nobody wants it to be that way, certainly in the West. But the, the, the concerns about Iran's nuclear program are not just confined to the US and, and Israel. They, they are very real and they are shared and we share them. Um, the, uh, the, the work of the IAEA has, has given rise to, to, I think, serious and justified uh, concerns. Um, the international community, which is grouped in this three plus three formation, I think has tried extremely hard to engage, uh, engage the uh, Iranian authorities genuinely to, uh, to seek to make uh, some progress on this. And, and, and frankly, they, it has not been forthcoming. Um, the sanctions uh, which have been, um, have been applied have very much been reply, applied rather as a, as a last resort. Um, and, and we have made every effort to, to try and find, that, that is we, the international community, to try and apply these in a way that will not uh, harm uh, the Iranian community. But obviously it's very difficult to apply sanctions, particularly when you have to keep winding them up to a higher level because you're getting no response to, to, to introduce sanctions that have no uh, impact in, in people uh, on, on the ground. There, there are, uh, as was pointed out, elections uh, in the next few days. Um, uh, we obviously sincerely hope that they will lead uh, to a more enlightened uh, approach on the, on the part of the Iranian administration. Um, because really the, the, the long-term situation is, is extremely worrying. I mean, the last thing one wants in, 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 in the Middle East region is, is another nuclear weapon state. And, uh, and that is something that obviously uh, the international community are very much trying to avoid, not just because we don't want another nuclear weapon state, but clearly some, there are some in, in the region who have made it very clear that they won't tolerate that and we don't. Uh, we don't. Uh, uh, nobody knows what the uh, the repercussions of that would be. We clearly, at, a, at all costs, want to avoid uh, military action, and um, and we want to see uh, Iran fully reintegrated into the uh, into the international community as a, as a country uh, that is cooperating on on uh, on nuclear uh, policies and and is free from sanctions. Uh, the, the May I just on, I was around Iran and I missed the questions. If I could just have one very brief question. Um, there are concerns that the sanctions are affecting um, the poorer people in Iran because of the, the lack of medical facilities and medical, you know, medicines getting through. And I did have it in as a, as a question. Um, and while the sanctions are intended for one thing, the repercussions are that it is the ordinary poorer Iranian people who are suffering because of them. So you wonder about their impact on the political world. Well, well, all I can say is they're clearly not. They are, every effort is made to to avoid uh, uh, harming uh, the poorer people. And, and, and but I, as I said, I think as the, as the sanctions are intensified, it is very, very difficult to to have sanctions that that that, that are not going to harm anyone on the ground. I think we did answer the the PQ on that uh, in in the. Uh, last couple of days, which I, nice. I, yeah, I don't nice. have in front of me. Mm -hmm. Pat might be able to come, uh, come back to you on that.